Tiana Taylor and Amon Shumpert are what many of us would call couple goals. The singer and her NBA star hubby live in a gorgeous home in Atlanta, Georgia alongside their daughters, and while it may seem like your regular luxe mansion on the outside, the interiors will make your jaw drop. Today, we're going to take a better look at the couple's pop artist estate and their former spot in Studio City. In these videos, we don't reveal any addresses, and even though I've done a house tour of my own place, please do not show up at any private residences because it's not safe for anyone. Singer, songwriter, and model Tayana Taylor is married to NBA champion Iman Shumpert and has been since 2016. Aside from their estimated net worth of about 35 to 40 million dollars, over five years of marriage, this happy couple also have two baby girls to be proud of. Junie, born in 2015, and Rue Rose in September of last year. Nothing all that unusual there, right? Well, now hold on a second. What if I told you that both of their children were delivered in their home bathtub? That's right, Tayana is seemingly all about delivering her children from the comfort of her own home. And that's not all. When she and Amon got married in 2016, they said I do while standing in the exact same spot their daughter was delivered. Tiana told GQ, It was like our bathroom in our room, so right in front of the bathroom. Pretty much. We got married at the crime scene. It was a really special moment to get married in that home. Period. Look, when your homes are something straight out of a fairy tale, you'd probably be willing to get married there too. The couple's original home in Studio City, Los Angeles was about as contemporary chic as they come, and every bit as glamorous. But the house they moved to in Atlanta, Georgia simply has to be seen to be believed. Speaking with E! Online about her family's new place in Atlanta, Tayana told them, I'm an aesthetic person. We want everything to look like a certain way. Well, today we're going to see just how true that really is. Hey guys, it's Karen. We're checking out the homes of Tayana Taylor and Amen Shumpert here for you on Famous Entertainment. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and add me on Instagram to chat. Now let's get into this video. About two years after they got hitched, Damon and Tayana scooped up a property in the Los Angeles neighborhood of Studio City for just under $3 million. Seen from the street, this five bedroom home is a strikingly contemporary figure with all types of angles intersecting at different planes. Meanwhile, inside the residence is much homier with neutral tones, stone tile floors, retractable glass doors, and impressive scale. After moving in here, the couple never made any changes to the interior, and why should they? The home was just built in 2017 and included some enticing smart home features spread throughout its roughly 5,700 square feet of space. The wide open floor plan combines a living room with a built in fireplace alongside a chandelier topped dining room and a gourmet chef's kitchen with a large center island, all of which is set in monochromatic tones. The main foyer boasts a gorgeous floating staircase with natural toned wood treads for a pop of color alongside a glass banister. Upstairs, all five of the bedrooms come with their very own ensuite bathroom. And yet this is the one home where Amon and Tayana seemingly did not deliver a baby in. I don't know if that lowers or raises the value of this place, but I'll tell you one thing that definitely does increase the value, the couple's at-home cinema. Towards the back of the home, two sets of 10 foot tall pocketing doors open up to the outside, which contains a zen themed backyard with an accompanying swimming pool and custom dog house. Oh, there's also a patio with a waterfall if you're ever in need of a little meditation in the early afternoon. As stunning as this home is, Tayana and Amon would decide to move off of it early last year and make the move to Atlanta, Georgia. They listed this home for just under $3.7 million. At this point, it remains unclear if anyone has purchased their former home. But that didn't stop the couple from packing up and moving into one of the most unique homes you've ever seen. So like I said, Tayana and Amon moved to Atlanta in the middle of 2020. At the time, Tayana told E! Online, This is a big deal for us because it's like restarting. In other words, it was a priority for Tayana to make her new place feel like home as quickly as possible, especially because it was going to be the setting for her and Amon's new series, We Got Love. Now, from the outside, I'm not gonna lie, this house, it doesn't look like much. Don't get me wrong, there's absolutely nothing wrong with the exterior. It just looks like a very average home. I promise you, the inside is anything but, and it starts the moment you step foot inside the couple's front foyer, which is clearly inspired by Alice in Wonderland with its black, white, and red all over color scheme. 
And guys, I'm just getting started with this place. Moving into the living room, it's been repainted in a truly gorgeous aqua blue and features some big comfy color matched furniture as well as enviable full wall bookcase that contains all of Tayana and Amon's many trophies and achievements. Alongside those blue and rust orange accents, Tayana also has chosen an array of pop artwork pieces, including painted skateboards, Roman inspired busts, and multiple bare brick statues. And if you guys think that living room is something, just wait until you see the dining room. For this next space, Tayana hired Atlanta based artist Mary Kate Whitman whom she had previously worked with on her music video for Concrete to transform her dining room into a monochromatic, cell-shaded masterpiece. When you're all finished checking out the main floor, you can get upstairs in one of two ways. The funky black and white winding staircase or the Willy Wonka-esque tube elevator. Once upstairs, you can lounge out on the couple's gigantic L-shaped couch or you can step foot into one of the multiple ginormous bedrooms that litter the top floor. It was inside one of those very ensuite bathrooms that Tayana recently gave birth to the couple's newest baby girl, Rue Rose, on September 6th. 2020. Only the day prior, Tayana had been throwing a baby shower, which must have got Rue all fired up to arrive early because a few hours later, she popped out in the couple's water filled bathtub. When asked by Hollywood Life if she and Amon plan on having any more kids, Tayana told them, Girl, listen to and done. You hear me? I just feel like my kids are that level of petty that none of them are going to let me make it to the hospital. But I think for now, two is enough. I got through it but it was an experience to be sure. So it sounds like Tiana and Amon are done having kids, at least for now. But how about that eye for design? Where did this love for cell shading and pop art come from? Tiana told the online, I've always loved movies and also cartoons, so this is something that really represents me. There's definitely still a lot more work to be done, but it feels good to finally be able to just have one place to call home. Well, if there's still more work to be done in this place, I can't wait to see it. I guess I'll just have to keep my eyes peeled on the next season of We Got Love to see if there have been any new additions. Until then, I'll wrap up this house tour. After checking out Tiana Taylor and Amon Shumpert's homes, both their former spot in LA and their current very unique mansion in Atlanta, which was your favorite? Be sure to let me know what you think about the couple's impressive homes down in the comments. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram, and I'll catch you all in the next one. Bye!